Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a significant move to bolster its defense capabilities, Norway has announced the commencement of domestic production of Leopard 2 tanks. This strategic initiative is the result of an agreement between the Franco-German holding KNDS and the Norwegian company Ritek, as reported by the Norwegian Ministry of Defense. Last year, Norway placed an order for 54 Leopard 2 tanks from the German group Krausmaffe Wegmann, with an option for an additional 18 vehicles. Initially, the plan was for all tanks to be assembled in Germany. However, the latest agreement stipulates that only 17 of these tanks will be assembled in Germany, with the remaining 37 to be assembled at the Ritek plant in Levanger, Norway. Norwegian Defense Minister Bjorn Areld Graham praised the collaboration between KNDS Deutschland and Ritek, marking it as a historic moment for Norway. For the first time, tanks will be assembled on Norwegian soil, enhancing the country's defense manufacturing capabilities and strategic autonomy. The Leopard 2A7, armed with a 120mm gun and featuring modern sloped armor on the turret, is the current iteration of the Leopard series. With over 3,500 units in use across 18 nations, the Leopard 2A7 is renowned for its balance of protection, comfort, and firepower, making it one of the most widely used modern tanks globally. Norway's decision to order the Leopard 2A7NO tanks aligns with NATO requirements for equipping a heavy mechanized brigade. However, in a strategic move influenced by the lessons learned from the conflict in Ukraine, Norway opted not to pursue the latest Leopard 2A8 version. Instead, the Norwegian government chose to allocate resources towards enhancing air defense systems and long-range artillery. This approach reflects a nuanced understanding of modern warfare, emphasizing the importance of a balanced and versatile military arsenal. The integration of the Leopard 2A7NO tanks is expected to significantly enhance Norway's ground forces, providing robust support for its heavy mechanized brigade. The production timeline is set, with Norway anticipated to receive all 54 tanks by mid-2027. This initiative not only strengthens Norway's military capabilities but also signifies a deeper collaboration within the European defense industry, showcasing the potential for international partnerships in enhancing national security. In summary, Norway's venture into domestic tank production represents a pivotal advancement in its defense strategy. By assembling the majority of its Leopard 2 tanks locally, Norway is poised to enhance its military readiness and contribute to the collective defense capabilities of NATO. This move underscores the importance of strategic foresight and international cooperation in modern defense planning. That's all for now, see you later.